culture. We want our culture to, to spread around. And with it being a melting pot that is, you know, especially in LA, that is the US, like, why is it not okay for people to love your stuff? It's like, oh, you can't eat our stuff. You're appropriating our food by eating it. Mm-hmm. You can't like lumpia. You can't like fried rice. That's our stuff. Get your own shit, man. It's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Um, I just thought I'd make a video here in response to um, this crazy social media moment that I found myself in um, as it pertains to. Uh... Motherfucker is talking for six minutes. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. That, that is long. That is right. long. I will watch like two minutes tops. Uh, yeah. Den Den and the boba of it all. Um, first and foremost, I want to say I think we hit on a really important discussion about cultural appropriation. And in that conversation, by the way, I've experienced a massive wave of positivity and support um, from people from every community. And I, and I just think that's really incredible. And I, and I really appreciate that. Um, on the flip side, I've been made aware that the business owners uh, have received a lot of um, the death threats and harassment and, and otherwise just kind of bullying and, and dogpiling. And I just want to say that full stop. Now, now here's the thing, right? So those, the, the death threats, the guy's a piece of shit. Full yeah, stop. Yes. Um, it's never okay to make threats. Um, it's never okay to bully and harass online. And what I mean by that, I, I don't mean, you know, I don't mean that, you know, the business owners don't deserve valid criticism. And I don't believe that you should not be vocal about your disagreement. But, you know, I think we can all agree, common sense, there's a line, there's a line that you don't and shouldn't cross. There's a line that you wouldn't cross in person. And I just don't want the legacy of this segment to be pitchforks and, you know, people fearing for their safety. I think we're starting to lose the plot of, of I think, what, what ultimately the positive energy of this is, which is let's educate people. Let's make the world a better place. Let's make people aware that, you know, certain things aren't okay from a cultural perspective.